Being a doctor sometimes can be hard, not because of the medicine itself, but because I have to translate things in plain English for my patients. Like today, I had a patient who has a prolonged PTT, and then I ended up ordering something known as an inhibitor assay, and that came back elevated, which means I have to order some additional lab tests like a factor eight, factor nine, factor 11, and von Willebrand factor to make sure that they don't have a bleeding disorder. I'll use another example. I had a patient who had an elevated white blood cell count, so I ordered not something known as a flow cytometry, which basically looks at the immune cells. It showed something known as a monoclonal B cell lymphocytosis. I had to explain to her that this could increase her risk of chronic lymphocytic leukemia, and we have to order an ultrasound to see if she has something known as splenomegaly, and I have to send out something known as a fish, which is to check for any chromosomal abnormalities. So imagine explaining all of that in a way that makes sense without freaking people out. Medicine isn't just science, it's basically being a full-time translator too.